Hey. Top of the morning, I'll tell you how to get it with your boy. I'm pretty sure for the baby. You find it. Hey. Gotta go over and help the old neighbor with a bed issue. So, let's go do that. <laughs> that was terrible. All right. And take two. Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, it's your boy, Fur Baby Fun Art, and we're gonna go help our neighbor Nancy with a bed issue. We're gonna take uh, the dogs. That should be a lot of fun. Come with us. Cha 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 cha. I'm just sucking on some candy. Just sucking on some candy. Hey guys, we're gonna finish this dog. Three hour, three hour block, three hour block, three hour block. Keep it short and simple. Just sucking on some candy. I'm gonna finish this painting in a three hour block. What are you doing? You look like you're in a music video. Are we rolling? Check one, check two, check one, check two. Greetings, everybody. Sitting here thinking about how, uh, so we're recording something and you're watching it. And so I was thinking about like 20 some years ago when I was in high school, how my mom had a VHS camcorder recorder. So she would show up to my high school events and record it on a tape. And then I was thinking about how my uncle, who's a bit older, didn't have that. Uh, his parents didn't have, the technology just didn't exist. Uh, what do you guys think about that? Do you guys ever think about the way that recording has evolved over the past 20 years? The last thought is that even though my mom had a camera and recorded it on a little tape, I don't have those tapes and if she handed them to me, I have no way to watch them because that technology, I don't have a VHS player, that technology doesn't exist either. So I'm just curious as to whether or not these digital videos that I'm making will have any relevance 20 years from now. There may be no Facebook, no YouTube, even the internet could be something that we can't even comprehend. What do you think? Let me know. Uh, something that got me thinking about this is that I was reading the Leonardo da Vinci book biography by Walter Isaacson. And so then I watched some of his uh, YouTube interviews. And he was talking about how when he was interviewing Steve Jobs 2005 to 2010... But they had a very difficult job retrieving his emails from the 90s, which in 2005 just would have been 10 years prior to that. And so when we think about the permanency of digital technology, it's actually not as permanent as what we think. And it may be harder to retrieve digital stuff in the future than what, what we think. Uh, because where does it actually exist? On your phone? On your computer? Uh, you won't have either one. You won't have this phone or your current computer five years from now or ten years from now. It just won't be functioning. Uh, so something to think about. Let me know what you think.